Hello, it's Flo and today I want to show you how to uh, be able to flash a custom ROM on your HTC Desire HD. So you must have a Desire HD with Froyo version 2.2 or less, not 2.2.1, nothing else. You can you can go to this version by using, for example, a RU, for example, this one. VRU 1.24.405.1 and you can see uh, the link on my previous article on how to downgrade your um, your HTC there HD. So this is the, this link for example. To go there you get how to downgrade HTC there HD from Android 2.3.5 main version is all the issue and you get the link there. When you get that, you have to be sure about some different things on your uh, GZR HD. You must have so on the settings and about phone, you must have software information, Android version 2.2 and not no more. Then you have to enable unknown sources. You have to go on applications there and unknown sources must be activated there and fast boot unchecked. You have now to go on application development and you have to activate USB debugging mode. You have just to wait one second and it must be activated. Then you have to connect your phone on charge only and you have to uh, to close the HTC Sync on your computer. Then now you can just click OK and let's go. Please wait while AMG acquires your device. Wise, your device. I am waiting. I am patient, you know. So, continue. Okay, so I have to test it. Okay, so I want to disable secure fly. I want to change set super user. I want to do that. And flash English boot, perm root, query device info. Please wait. Checking with starting AGB server. Done. Okay, so you have something there. Uh, supported ROM. Okay, uh -huh. commit change, uh, reboot to recovery when finished, and set flag as on. Okay. Device when finished, commit changes and clear log, install APK, don't go at home, verify and step step one, commit changes and support at home. And you have to press what we have to press then. Okay, so we have to press query device info and we have to see if it works there. Ok, done. What is done? Uh, I change to C per CIG. Device connected, restarting AGB server. Querying AGB. I don't see what's happened. Commit changes, checking device connection, device connected, restarting. Maybe there is something more there. I don't know. Attempting to temp up. Okay, we have to to click on commit changes. Just wait. Pushing requires files to device. Pushing H put ang to device. Checking root access. Attempting to temp root out device. Temp root success. Calculating MG5 checksum of current H boot image. Flashing H ang H boot image. MG5 check. Setting super CD. Attempting to perm root device. Perm perm root success. Sync syncing device, changing temporary files, rebooting device and you can see there my phone is rebooting and rebooting on uh, device. So we can uh, if needed uh, check if the recovery is installed so we have to reboot our phone on recovery and we have also to check if S off is done. So let's go to test it. Set secure flag disable. So. so wait one second.
okay so iPhone is now uh, rebooting loading okay excuse me menu and let's go menu settings and we have to charge only okay uh, check for our server no it's applications fast button check okay so let's go to power off our phone and we have to check the fast boot information and if we get the S off or no and if we get super CID for example we have to wipe the orange light just there and then we can just reboot yes let's go I am rebooting on bootloader, you know. Okay, so now I get uh, S off just there, and this is okay. Oh no, shit. I forgot to remove the SD card. So there is the, um, excuse me, there is the PG98 IMG into that. Okay, so let's go to reboot my phone. Now on recovery just to see if it's okay. Okay, so edge boot, recovery, and we have to check if recovery is flushed or not. We get an error. So we have now to flush the recovery by ourselves. How to do that? You have to just connect our phone on fast boot mode on your computer. So let's go to do that. You connect it on fast boot. And we connect it in fastboot to SB mode. We have to launch a CMG command there. Okay, CMG there. We have to go. Okay, would you like to kill ADB server? Yes. We have to go on our files. This is CG C. Excuse me. There. Uh, double point backslash Android SGK Windows backslash tools okay we have to go on our Android SDK tools I have a test folder with the air touch okay this is this one which interests me air touch and we have to do uh, fast boot flush recovery air touch excuse me fair touch dot img there sending recovery okay working okay and now we can just reboot on bootloader there we have to go on the recovery not factory reset recovery and we must get the recovery now this is the touch recovery and we get there the recovery so it works and now we can just uh, flash a custom room so let's go to show you how to do that just reboot system now and let's go to the next video. Patos flow!